Hi, I'm Jason from Barbecue Spit Rotisseries. Today I'm going to show you how to make a quick and simple pizza dough recipe. So in our recipe today we have flour, yeast, salt and water. What we're going to do first is combine the yeast and the salt with the flour and just mix it in. Then we'll add the water in. We'll mix this up until it becomes a little bit doughy and then we'll take it out and start to knead it. Before we take it out to knead it, we'll just put some flour down on our chopping board here so that the dough doesn't stick. Cut it down and we'll knead this for about eight minutes. Once you finish kneading for eight minutes, we're going to want to chop the dough into evenly proportioned dough balls. In this recipe, we should get a roughly four dough balls of 200 grams each. So we'll cut it and just weigh it. Yeah. Once we've cut our dough into their individual dough balls, we'll grab the dough and just roll it again into a nice dough ball and put it into our proofing tub. Once we put the dough balls into the dough tub to proof, we'll just put the lid on so that it's airtight. These dough balls will proof in roughly one hour and they would double in size in that time. Now that our dough has proof for an hour, I'm going to show you how to stretch and top a pizza. So first what we want to do is just put some polenta on our tray. It'll help it not stick to the tray during the cooking process. What we want is just to put our dough patty in the middle, squash it down, and then gently just start to stretch from the middle out to the edge. We're using a 30 centimeter pan here, which is roughly 10 to 11 inches. And we just keep stretching right to the edge. Keep pulling from the middle, make sure it's nice and even. All right, now we've got a nicely stretched base. We'll put some sauce on. Just wanna make sure we're not putting on too much. Otherwise you might find that our base will go soggy. We'll make a simple pepperoni pizza with this one. Just grab some of our cheese, spread it over nicely, nice and even. And then start with some pepperoni. Now that our pizza oven is ready and up to temperature, we're going to cook our pizzas. For the first pizza, we're going to cook it half the time on the pan, half the time on the brick to ensure that the pizza cooks all the way through and that we crisp up the base a bit. After around 60 to 80 seconds, we'll want to take the pizza off the base and slide it onto the brick. A pizza in the Flaming Coals pizza oven will take anywhere between 90 seconds and 180 seconds to cook. 